Good morning guys, welcome back to another video. Now, this is going to be quick, so I haven't set the green thing up. I was going to, but then it wouldn't fit somewhere. I, I, no, not doing it. Anyway, yesterday, uh, I was very shocked to find out that the one and only Russell T Davis is going to be the new showrunner of Doctor Who in 2023. I was really surprised. I was on the way home from work and I was looking on Twitter and I saw Russell T Davis returning to Doctor Who. Great news. Russell T Davis, Doctor Who. Great news. It's like, what? No. No way. I looked on the Doctor Who official Twitter. Russell T Davis returned to Doctor Who in 2023 for the 60th anniversary and series beyond. Guys, I don't think you understand how good this news is. If you're not a Doctor Who fan, I don't think you understand how, how much, how good this news is. It confirms we are getting a 60th anniversary, which everyone, almost everyone said we weren't going to get. Are we going to get a series in 2023? My guess is no, but I'm not sure. I hope we would. Really being Russell, um, because they've got the whole 2022 to film it and they're looking for a doctor as we speak. So I can't see why they can't do a series in 2023. Um, if you don't know who Russell T. Davis, Davis is, this is the person that brought back Doctor Who in 2005. He created Rose, he cast David Tennant and Chris Wilkinson as the doctors, he created Donna, he created Martha. He created Captain Jack. You know, Doctor Who was the best in his era. So this news I'm very, very excited for. Especially, I've got a really good feeling about the 60th anniversary. I don't think Jodie Whittaker is going to come back, unfortunately, as much as I'd like to have for her to meet previous Doctors. I don't think that's going to happen. Because she would have just left. It'd be way too soon. I just can't see her coming back, unfortunately. David Tennant, probably. Matt Smith, most more um, quite likely. Chris Second, probably not. Uh, Peter Capaldi, probably not. I might be a fan of his anyway. Um, and then obviously the new Doctor, 14th Doctor. So, if we do get that, it's kind of going to be a repeat of the 50th. Um, so maybe they won't do that then. I don't know what they're going to do. I think it will depend on if we get a series in 2023. Because then if we get a series in 2023, there's something to go on. They can build it up to the 60th. Yeah, I'm not sure who's going to be in the 60th now. Now I thought of it that way. I'm not sure. I kind of want, I do want a multi Doctor story, but I want Jodie in it. You know, even if they don't do a series in 2023. I don't know. Anyway, right. So the things I think are going to happen with Russell. So they said that series beyond. Hopefully, hopefully it's not just one series. Hopefully it's going to be a couple of good years. Um, and hopefully a good, maybe... Hopefully, good period, like eight years, five years maybe, at the minimum, hopefully. Um, I can't see him doing one series. Russell C. Davis is a big fan of the show, so I can't see him doing one series and bugging off. I just can't see it happening. Um, I'm kind of hoping he stays with multiple Doctors as well. I think that's quite interesting. That's a long shot, but we'll see. Um, so... I think Russell C. Davis is going to bring it back in the spring. I think he's going to go back to the original format. So, let me explain. Spring air date. It's maybe not 13 episodes. Again, I'm not sure about that. I like the 10. I think 10's enough. I think 13 is a bit long. Especially for science fiction drama. Um, air in the spring. Christmas specials. Not New Year specials, Chris, Chris Chipnall. New Christmas Day spe specials, please, Russell. Uh, 
see this every single year without a gap. Minus 2023. Um, I've said to bring a Yeah, I think that's what's going to happen. Yeah, I'm. As you can see, I'm really excited about this. I had to. I, I didn't want to film this video yesterday because I hadn't had time to process it. But I've had time to process it and think about it. And I think this is really good. This could bring Doctor Who back to how it was in 2005, 2010. So I'm quite excited. Right, let me know what you think about Russell's return. I'm not going to babble on for ages this time. Um, I'm not going to do any series predictions because uh, it's pointless because we don't know anything. Um, final word do I think there'll be a series in 23? I can't see why not. I can't see why not. They haven't said they are, but I just don't know why they want to. If they cast the Doctor now, they're not going to. I'm going to say they're not going to film a series of two years in advance, but they do do that. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Um, they did film most of the last year in advance. Okay, maybe not. I don't think we will. That's my final word. I don't think we're going to get a series into anything. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you think about Russell's return. Uh, let me know if you're excited. Let me know if you, you think this will bring back Doctor Who to its peak. Like it was in 2005, 2010. Um, I'm very excited, as you can see. Um, I'm looking forward to series 13 still. And the three specials. That's another thing. I can't see them doing two years of that series. I think that would be ridiculous. I don't know. We'll just wait and see. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye guys.